Hi, I'm Leah Saunders and I work at NZCER in Assessment Services. I've made some short videos to show you how to navigate through the ARB site. Hopefully these videos are nice and helpful. In this short video, I'm going to show you how to view results for your ARB resources that you've sent URLs to students for. I'm also going to show you how to delete results for old students that you don't need anymore or whether you just want to get rid of one of the records. The first thing I'm going to do is go in to my account and I'm going to log in to the admin part of my account. Now the admin shows me this uh, information to start with. I can go into completed resources tab. This shows me the resources that I've given out URLs to and the resources that have results in there for you. I can search a couple of ways. I could search by the resource name. So if I had a lot of resources in here, I can search for that. I could also search by a student name if I wanted to see all the resources that one particular student had completed. If you click search, it will come up with a list down here. I'm going to go into my packing food for the Hungi resource. I have two students that have completed this and I can go in and I can see how they answered. The other thing I can do is for individuals, I could view the student's results by clicking on the view button. It shows me how the student answered in here. I could also do a download of their results. So this is the way I can view individual student results. The other thing I can do is I can click on the CSV file here and it will download a CSV to my computer. So as I go in here, it gives me a CSV for all the results for those students. Okay, it gives me the token code that they entered and it gives me information on their session and what they entered for the different questions. If I wanted to remove a student's result because I no longer need it, all I need to do is click on the student's tick checkbox next to their name and then click delete student results. Confirm that you are sure you want to do that. And then they're no longer in your list anymore. And that's how you view results and delete results for students. 